Hi guys, welcome back to Sai Sri Coding. So today, in this video, we are going to do an, uh, another project on MAT App Inventor. So this is our project, Translation. So when you click English to French, if you speak anything, it will translate to French. If you speak anything in French, it will translate to English. So now I will give an example. La Revolution. See, you can see that the French word of revolution has came here. And this is a project, guys. Now we can see the code. Hi, guys, welcome back to Side Key Coding. So, today we are going to do a program called Translator. Which will do an un MAT app inventor. So, <coughs> the first you see that I click the button one and say revolution, it has changed to a French language. So, like that, we are going to do some more words. So, whatever words you said, will translate to French. So, we can start our code. So, it will start new project. It will name it as translator. After naming it, you click OK. Wait for some time, it get open. So you can see that the screen went as open here. So first, go to layout and take vertical arrangement and place it inside screen one. Change it as full parent and with also as full parent. Now we are going to add some buttons and labels. So for that, click again in the user interface, take two buttons and place it here. And take two labels also. Click vertical arrangement. You can see align horizontal. Change it as center 3 and this is center 2. You can see that it's placed in the center. Now we can do some changes in the color. So, I change the background color as green and the button one's color as magenta and we can also rename it now we can rename it as English to French and click enter now for button 2, you can change the color, I change it as here, whatever color you want you can change it. So now I give French to English. I click enter. Now change this. This as Translation and we can also change the color for it. And do the same here. Translation. And you have to change the color for it. And now we are going to add some external parts. So for that, go to search box. Here, search speech recognizer. And place it here. To place, it will go down here. Because these are non-visible components. So we are going to add some more two non-visible components. And written in this text to speech. Also place it here. It's also went down. And next we are going to add Yandex translator. This helps to translate. The same thing. You see that all the three non-visual components are right here. Now we can go for the code part. Click the continent.
Now, click each time the gun is set. Choose the first one. Next, go to controls. You can see it's the knife here. You can drag and drop it here. Oh, sorry, it's just not app to one. So then we are going to choose Now go to speech recognizer. Take the first one and place it here. Go to controls. Take this one. Here we are going to do some changes. So click the settings here. Keep the L shift, drag and drop, and put it here. And then take this L here. And now it's done. Now we can place it inside. Now go to logics. Take this one and place in it. Now go to math and choose the number slot and place it here. Now go to variables. Take the initial global. See the most question on it, this appears. So take get global name and place it here. Now go to context translate. Take this and place it inside this bin. Now click test. You can see letter slot here. Drag and drop it here and set it here. Here we are going to place if R. That means French. This is the code for English to French. Next, go to speech recognizer. Take this first one and place it here. Now, again go to label. Here you can see set label. Drag and drop it here and place it here. And change this as text. And here we are going to do the same thing which you put in there. So right click on it and duplicate it and put it here. We are going to do the same thing which we did here. So right click it and duplicate it. Place it here. Then also duplicate this. Then place it here. Also duplicate this one. Now we are going to do some changes in it. Change this as 1 and this as EN, that means English. Now click Yandex Translate. Take this one, const translated. Now take text to speech. Here you can see call text to speech speak and place it here. And again, see the most question on it. You can get global. You can change it as translation. Next, go to label 2. Take this one. We can change it. I will arrange this so it will be easy to do. So we can change this as text. And duplicate this one. And place it here.
now a button 2 here you can see button to click now go to speech recognition take call speech recognition get text and paste it here and again give the mouse cursor on it you can see get global and you can paste it here now go to Mac, take the number slot and place it here. You can change it as zero. Now you can duplicate. You can change this as button one, and this is button one. And that's it, guys. Our code part is over. Now we can build screen for it so click build click the QR code it's getting processed is getting loaded so in our last video i said that download QR code scanner or we can use google lens this is a somewhat bigger app so it takes more time to load If the app is built using this app, you can learn easily French because whatever words you see that will be recognized by the phone and it translates into French. So even you can say thank you in French to others. That may be a different one to say. And that's it the barcode has been up here now i'll come in my phone hi yeah, guys now i have came in my phone so today i'm going to say an, another way to use that app so if you have qr code scanner you can also do with that now i'm going to say a different way to do so for that click play store here type mit ai2 companion i have already downloaded so i you open here here you can also connect with the code and also scan QR code. So now I click scan QR code. Now you can see connect here. Click it. Press A companion. Now it has scanned. It will take some time to load. In between this time you can see the loading things appear there. Now I click English to French. Bienvenue. Now you can see that I, I spoke welcome and it recognized it and it came as the French word for welcome. And that's it guys. This is my project. If you want, you can also try, try different words. Merci. You can see then another example 
so if you like this video share this like this and don't forget to subscribe our channel science recording bye until next video